video. Um, today's Friday. Decided to uh, drive out to Mount Hood National Forest and trying to see if I could uh, find some mushrooms. Uh, we had our first kind of frosty weather, so we might not be able to find any. And it's been kind of dry so far this uh, this fall. But either way, we're gonna give it a shot and see if we can find anything. Came to our first spot here where I was gonna check things out and see if I could find any kind of mushrooms, bad or good. So I'm trying to find some chanterelles, but when you see a sign of bad ones, you know there might be good ones also. So let's go, let's go take a look. So the road's right there. And I actually found some. There's another one right there. And just like I thought, the top of them are frozen, but they still look all right. They're not black or anything. Let's see if we can cut this one out. they'll be alright. Let's continue looking. Whenever I see bad ones, I know there's got to be good ones around here. So let's keep walking down this whole logging road and see if we find any more. Here's a great example of what I'm looking for. These are the really bright yellow ones. And I came across this, looks like an old clearing here. And you see right there? Look how bright and yellow they are. Even though frost kind of got to them. But I'm gonna pick through them and get, get the good stuff. But if you, uh, if you wanna learn how to do this stuff, I would recommend going with somebody that knows what they're looking for and uh, explain to you exactly what you're looking for. And uh, that's the best way to do it, in my opinion. Don't try to go by photos or videos. Go with somebody that knows what they're doing. It makes it a lot easier. So I'm gonna cut these out and uh, continue searching. I walked about a mile down this uh, road and uh, didn't have as much luck as I did in the beginning. So it's kind of starting to sprinkle a little bit. I'm gonna get back to the car, continue driving and see if I can find something else. Some other spot to uh, go look in, but check out this view here. I don't know, let's keep going.
righty, made it back to the car. I'm gonna unload all these. I don't wanna maybe go down there and then see what we have maybe behind me over here. And after that, we'll continue on. See if I can find any any other ones around here. Well, my rod has to be rerouted. I have to turn around, close this area off. I guess due to the wildfires. So I'm gonna turn around, head back, and uh, find another uh, another road uh, where I came from. So I took another road here, came to this spot. I'm gonna try to go up there, see if I can find anything and look around here. Sucks this year, we had all these fires, everything's been, all the areas that I go to usually are all closed off due to wildfires. You can't get anywhere right now, so gotta work with what you got. So let's take a look. Well, no luck in this area. I spent like 20-30 minutes walking around here and haven't been able to find anything so I call it a day and get out of here. So thanks a lot for watching. I guess better luck next year for me and I'll uh, see you guys in the next video.